This video is going to come out a little out of sequence, but one thing I noticed uh, was that as I was doing the other videos that these floor plates were kind of right adjacent to uh, the building. So I want to adjust that. Um, what I'd like to do is we're going to try to uh, just adjust it in Rhino and then bring it in. So let's just kind of get rid of or hide some of this stuff. We're going to adjust this uh, volume here. So let's just do that HI, the hide invert. And we'll move the face. And now what I'm trying to do is just get it um, that foot or so increment away from the outside surface. So I'll just do that to both of these surfaces. Just using the move face command. Okay, and now let's export that again. Make sure that you export it as a SAT. This is the floor plate form. And then let's go back into Revit. And we will manage links and floor plate and reload. Alright, so you can see that, let's see what happened. My sense is that this thing shifted, but the floor plates did not. So what I want you to do is click on a floor plate, plate and up to update to face. So let's click on all of our floor plates. You can see that it moved immediately up date to face and see that worked great. So now we have that cleanup. Alright, that's it.